Hi, I'm Ryan Villapoto. Welcome to this week's Thor Riding Tour. Right handball turn going into the whoops here at my house. Um, <clears throat> it's obviously a little bit tougher. It's been raining out. Um, it's got a, a rut that basically starts from the beginning to the end that goes into the whoops. Um, it's obvi that's obviously harder than just a nice bowl turn that has no rut in it. Um, the dirt's a little bit softer, so you got to be a little bit easier on the easier on the front brake. Um, what I do, obviously, there's a rhythm section before it. <clears throat> the last rhythm section is just a double into the turn, and uh, I just do the double, look <clears throat> into the turn, um, you know, just try to keep, I I'm not very good at looking far, you know, looking in front of me very far, but I try to do it the best I can, and, and <clears throat> wherever you're looking, you, you tend to follow, your bike tends to follow you, so I come in there, um, look basically the middle of the turn, um, make sure I carry my speed in there, get off both of the brakes, lean the bike over, and then by the time I get to that point, I should be looking by at the end of the turn and looking to go inside, go into the whoops. It's easier than a flat rutted turn because you have a bank that you can come in there hot. You know, you, you have something to that's going to stop you if you end up missing the rut or, or not. You know, if it's a flat turn, you end up missing the rut, then hopefully there's another one on the outside of it or on the inside of it. If not, you kind of just got to try to turn the bike up where it's flat. But this here, if you miss the rut, then you have something that's behind you that you can that you can turn off as long as you don't go over the berm. Um, Body positioning, when I when I come in the turn, like I said, I look towards the middle of the turn, get it, come in there with <clears throat> with my speed, let off both of the brakes, um, sit down, foots out, and middle of the bike, really. I not from, I would I don't ride like really far forward in the rut. You more you more kind of almost not like sitting back, but in the middle of the bike and and like I said, looking forward, going into the whoops. Um, if you're looking down at your front fender or your front wheel right in front of you, you don't really know what's coming up next, um, what the rut does, and that you have the tendency to have the, the front end knife on you when, when that happens. Applying the throttle in obviously a, a, a rut and a softer, you really can give it everything it's got and, and be pretty aggressive on it. Um, the earlier you get on the gas, in the turn, the you know the faster you're gonna be. That's the key um, to going faster. Is the quicker the, all all the times made up in turns on a supercross track or in motocross. Everybody goes down the straightaways really the same speed, or they can. But you know it depends on how fast you do that corner that comes on, onto the straightaway that is is determines if you're gonna pass that guy or not. You know, so um, the quicker you get on the gas, the smoother you are in the turn, the faster you're gonna be. Thank you.